In this video tutorial, I am going to show you how to update your UHI Communities profile. Once you have logged into UHI Communities, one of the first things you will want to do is update your profile. With a few quick and easy changes, you'll be able to make your presence on the system known to other users. The first thing to notice is the row of buttons at the top of the screen. Home, Your Blog, Your Files, Your Network, Your Resources, your profile and forums. These buttons take you directly to the main features of the UHI Communities environment. We can start by looking at your profile. This will open up the profile page which will show you the information currently held in your profile. If you have not entered anything yet this will be empty. To update this information click on the Edit This Profile link with your mouse. You can now see a list of fields into which data can be added. The first option is to add a profile photograph. Because the fields can be filled in in any order and at any time, we will deal with this one later. Moving down the page, for each of the fields, take a few moments to think about what you might want to type. Remember that other users will use this information to create communities and find people with common interests. In the interest section, you should think about adding professional, research or educational interests. Use the likes and dislikes section to highlight social interests. In the skills section, you might want to include personal skills and achievements. And remember, you can cut and paste information from a CV or portfolio into any of these sections. Do take note of the instructions above each of the fields, where it asks for a list separated with a comma, this information will be used to facilitate searching. Where you have used words or short phrases that are common to others in the UHI community's environment, these will appear as tagged links. To find other people with similar interests to yourself, simply click on one of these links to reveal like-minded users. For tags to work, they need to be identical, so think about using the singular form of the required word. Keep individual entries to one or two words, but remember you can add items to your profile at any time, and you might get some idea of keywords to add when you start to search through the system. Moving back up to the top of the screen, you will notice that there are a series of tabs. We have just completed the basic details, but you should now work your way through each tab providing as much information as you feel you want to. Location, contact, employment and education. One of the great features of UHI Communities is the ability to decide who can see the various pieces of information that you have provided. Click again on the Basic Details tab and scroll down to below the Who Am I box. The Access Restriction drop-down list allows you to decide who can see the information in this particular field. Access can be restricted to yourself by selecting Private or open to other logged in users. Remember, for others to find your information in UHI Communities, you have to ensure that your interests, likes, dislikes, etc. are set to logged in users. Or, if you want to make your information more widely available, these should be set to public. A word of warning though, do take some care when deciding who has access to personal contact information. You may, for example, be happy to share your email address with everyone in UHI communities, but may want to restrict your telephone number to a very specific group of users or perhaps keep it private. The access restrictions allow you to tailor the access rights for each element in your UHI Communities profile. You can update your profile at any time simply by selecting the Your Profile button at the top of the screen and then selecting Edit Your Profile. The last thing you might want to do is upload a photograph of yourself. To add the profile photograph, you first need a picture which you can access from your computer. If you already have an image, then all you need to do is click on the Browse button and locate the image. Select the image and click Open. Now tick the box to verify that this is a photograph of you. The image will be inserted when you save the profile later. Once you have worked your way through the various fields, you will need to click on the Save Your Profile button to ensure that your profile is updated. Move down to the bottom of the screen and click Save Your Profile. There are screenshot help documents to support this activity. But if you need assistance with UHI Communities, please contact UHI Help Desk on telephone 150 
or by email at 150 at uhi.ac.uk.